In this video, let's learn about chemical indicators that help us identify whether the given chemical is an acid or a base. So what is a chemical indicator? Chemical indicator is a substance that indicates the presence of an acid or a base. These indicators can either undergo color changes or changes in their odor. Color indicators are visual indicators, that is, you can make out the changes in their color when in acidic or basic solutions. Litmus is one such example. Litmus paper is one of the commonly used color indicators in the lab. Under acidic conditions, litmus is red in color and in base, the litmus turns blue. Neutral litmus is purple in color. Litmus is basically a water-soluble mixture of different dyes extracted from lichens. Substances like turmeric, red cabbage, colored petals of flowers like butunia, geranium can also act as color indicators. Chemicals like methyl orange and phenolphthalein are few indicators that are also used in laboratories. Olfactory indicators are those indicators whose smell varies depending upon whether it is mixed with an acidic or basic solution. Onion and vanilla extract are olfactory indicators. Based on the sources of these indicators, indicators can be natural indicators or synthetic indicators. Those indicators that have plant origin are natural indicators and the indicators that are chemical are called synthetic indicators. Here, litmus, turmeric, red cabbage, colored flower petals, onion and vanilla extract are derived from plants, so they are natural indicators. Methyl orange and phenolphthalein are chemicals, so they are synthetic indicators. To sum up, we have learned about chemical indicators and different types of chemical indicators. Did you know that chemical indicators can also be used to indicate humidity and temperature? Humidity indicators are used in packaging and temperature indicators are used to monitor sterilization processes.